all right what's up guys uh back to another video um i wanted to do one on the emergency lighting that i have for or have done on my truck uh for responding to fire calls um so basically the setup i have is i have phoenix apollo dual color blue white uh dash light i have t6s up front these are 40 degree uh, directionals and likewise down at the bottom of the bumper they are also 40 degree directionals basically my light will come straight out I also have I don't know if you can really see them but I have 180 degree directionals on both sides of the truck that are a wider spread uh, light in the back I have two um, Whalen Ion blue white duels uh, when the blue lights are engaged those will be blue when I go into reverse it automatically goes into an override where they automatically light up white um, enhancing my reverse lighting in the tail lights I have Whalen vertexes I have nothing in the back window at all um, so what I will do is I will go through the features with it I'll light up the rear let you see that and then I will light up the front uh, the other function I do have uh, on the dash light is let me kill that annoying ass shit um, is a solid blue or sorry solid white setup act as a scene light um doesn't really light up a whole lot but i do have a bull bar coming that has a built-in led which that'll do the same function as the visor light so it'll actually give me a pretty solid um scene lighting up front everything else is all blue with the exception of the license plate lights they are blue white so basically on my mini 4200 i have front lights rear lights and scene light and then over here I have for my bed lights I'm still undecided on what I'm going to use these two outputs for I'll cross that bridge probably down the road but I will turn on the rear lights right now with the rear I have the side warning also engage because they're behind the front doors so I figured I'd just have them come on with the rear Generally, I will just click over to the rear when I'm pulling out of my driveway anyway with the fronts on. Um, however, the way my driveway is, I needed the side warning because I have multiple intersections I come into to pull out. Um, so and with the front lighting, you can see it definitely a lot better when I'm behind you. But as far as lighting output, when I'm at an intersection, uh, it isn't that great. And then this is the setup up front. Let's see if I can get it to where you can see it. I do have the T6s in an alternating pattern where they make an X. They slow down, speed up, and the the dash light I have on just a solid double hit pattern and the scene light or takedown function overrides the blue into a steady burn white and the grills still stay blue and on the same flash pattern that they were originally on. So I don't think I'm going to add any headlight flashers to it. I think I'm pretty much done with the exception of uh, the bull bar coming in and uh, wiring up that LED into the, uh, the scene lighting for the front. Um, I don't think I'm going to add any more lighting to the truck. Uh, what I have on it is very sufficient. I don't, I don't foresee me putting a light in the back window um 
I was thinking about moving the side lights that I have mounted on the side of the body up into the interior on the door, but I kind of like them where they're at. Plus, with the Nerf bars, it kind of it's just not a light hanging down where if I didn't have Nerf bars on it. Um, and they they project up, so instead of projecting straight out, they're actually projecting up at almost like a 45 degree angle. So, and with them being a 180, it actually covers uh, basically the span of my front fender to my rear fender and the lighting being shown out uh, from the from the light itself. So. I say in all my videos, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Uh, if I don't know the answer, I'll do some research and get back to you normally within a day, maybe two. Um, and I will keep doing some uh, some modifications to the RAM. Um, there's actually some other things that I have in the works that, uh, that I'm gonna be doing. I have an intake up there that I'm gonna put on and uh, maybe different wheels, although I kind of like the uh, the matte black factory wheels. Um, definitely really into this truck. Uh, I've only seen a couple like it, um, and the ones that I did see do not have the factory black headlight housings, so that's kind of badass. Um, I looked at aftermarket ones, but the only difference is this part here is just clear where I'm very much content with that being amber and it still being the black housing I may upgrade the tail lights and the cargo light to uh, LED um, but I don't know I'll cross that bridge when I get to it um, I still want to weigh out some things and see if that's something I'm gonna like uh, or at least you know maybe I'll just end up tinting these tail lights but um, I think I'm leaning more towards the aftermarket LED tail lights and aftermarket LED uh, cargo light. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching and feel free to subscribe.